So we are made it to Fiji. Last four nights, five days of the adventurous trip is here in Fiji. And we are spoiling ourselves. And I'm getting the opportunity to spoil Kim. Kim doesn't know this yet, so I might as well tell her here. But while we're here tomorrow, we're gonna take a day cruise away to an island, a small island. There's only a handful of people. And it's supposed to be a nice private cruise with a lunch and own snorkeling out there and a bunch of other stuff off a private island that the, uh, the cruise has. So it's, uh, we're gonna be able to go out and spend the day at the island. Hopefully the weather holds out for us so we can do that. And I'm really looking forward to spoiling you there too. But it's supposed to be some beautiful properties and beautiful places to go. So that's our thing tomorrow. And then we'll have, I have one, well, she kind of knows about it already, but I have one other trick up my sleeve, but I already kind of told her about that one. So other than that, we're just going to relax and enjoy it. So we'll... the water's not very clear right now, but I think we came in after a storm. Um, so hopefully it'll clear up a little bit, but it's so warm. It, like, oh, it's so good. You know, any water we got in New Zealand is really cold, but this water is nice and warm, like anything, bath water. Warm. Anything above 60 degrees right now feels good. <laughs> The water's probably, I'd say, 80, 85 degrees. It feels great. You see the mountains back there? It kind of reminds behind me of us. Queenstown a little bit. Yeah, a little bit behind us. A little bit out in front of us. There's several islands out in the bay here. So we're in Denaru, Denarau, Denarau Island at the Sofitel, Sofitel Fiji Resort and Spa. So we're going to enjoy it. Hello. Welcome to our suite. So I've already tried out the bed a couple times. That's why it looks unmasked of it. It's uh, so soft. It's super, super soft. Um, this wasn't the room we originally got uh, rented or what do you call it? Scheduled. Scheduled. Um, however, Book. it was available and so they allowed us to upgrade it for a certain price. And since one of our excursions in New Zealand got canceled, we had a little bit extra cash and we thought the benefits of having this suite that come with the suite was worth it to us since this was kind of a once in a lifetime opportunity for us. So, show you around. Um, this is our mini bar. Um, has all the regular um, coffees and teas and whatnot here. And then, you know, everything that you can, you know, pay for down here. Has its own little couch, little sitting area. And I always, I love, this is the second place we've been to it has our name on the screen, which I think is super cool. And then right here, we have these little waters that I've never seen before, but they're complimentary and they're pretty cool. I like them and I love these. I want to take them with me. I just need their candy. But my favorite part is the bathroom. The bathroom is huge. It's like bigger than our room back home. It's huge. So I'll show you our bathroom. So first you have the shower as soon as you walk in and you have a separate bathroom area, which I like. So we don't have to, you know, try and get ready while somebody's using the restroom. And then, you know, you can put all your odds and ends stuff here. They have a place for, you know, your laundry. But it comes with slippers, which is so excited. And then they give you this bag full of tons of, like, um, what do you call them? Gifts, handouts, no. complimentary items, yeah. bathroom I'm, necessities. I'm really big on that for some weird reason, but um, they gave us a lot, so I thought that was pretty cool. And then, uh, of course, you have your um, robes, which I think we'll be using a lot of, because my favorite feature is just behind Steve, we have an outdoor tub. I'm so excited about that. I love outdoor showers, tubs. Neat thing, I'll show you in a minute, but these are the um, towel thing here, um, a huge double sink with some super cool amenities. That's the word I was looking for, the amenities. So it comes with, um, what is that? Oh, more amenities. <laughs> They're so cute. Oh my gosh, I love this place. So anyways, um, little scrubby things, which I've never seen at a motel before. You can tell we need to get budget stuff, I think. <laughs> so, I'm a cheap person, but I thought this one time I'd be okay with Steve splurging. Um, but this is, ah, more amenities. This is our- Word of the day is amenities. <laughs> this is our tub, which, you can't feel the breeze obviously, but is a huge breeze coming off 
of the ocean because we are literally right next to the ocean. And we got a little sitting area here. So, and you can see our view. Our view is huge. It's very humid. It's not very hot right now. It's just very humid. Um, it's been kind of raining most of the day. So I think we're gonna try and uh, take some time, walk along the beach, maybe get some more pictures of the property, and uh, kind of show you. Like I don't know if you can tell, but they've got more things. Like our, we have access to the adult-only pool, which has my future resting spot right there in one of those hammocks. <laughs> um, but our suite comes with access to the adult-only uh, section of the resort which is normally $100 a day, well, we get it with our suite. So basically we paid half that price for our room each night as opposed to getting the adults only for like, what, an hour or something like that? I don't know, yeah. for the day, oh, 24 pretty, hours, 24 yeah. Hours, yeah. So it's pretty cool. Um, but anyways, so it's just it's amazing. It's really nice and really excited about this. And then it obviously goes right back into our room here. So you can leave the screen open at night with the wind, which I'm a huge fanatic for leaving screens and doors open. So we'll probably do that. We'll see. Depends on how hot it gets. <laughs> I got me some awesome brownie points.